two of the most famous custom rooms and i think so most of you are already aware of these custom rooms which customer i'm talking about is lineage os versus pixel experience plus edition pixel experience plus edition is what i'm using right now no major differences in pixel experience or pixel experience plus edition we'll talk about that later on and i already made a specific video on pixel experience versus pixel experience plus make sure to find out that but in this video this is lineage os versus pixel experience plus addition some of the major changes or some of the minor changes or similarities we will talk about all of those in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end you can see the ui right now a i'm using right now is lineage os and you can see this is how the ui is looking like pure aosp and it's not having any kind of pixel apps pre-installed yes you can install them manually but by default these things are not included whereas if you use pixel experience custom home things are a little bit different the ui is just absolutely amazing having all the pixel features having all the google apps pre-installed and some things like that so this is the major difference between lineages and pixel experience if you need pixel goodies you shall try out pixel experience secondly if you talk about lineage os lineage os has two editions you have the normal stock lineage OS, but you also have the micro g edition which you can find out on their website so if you need some google play services but without having play store and some kind of things installed you can use micro g variant but if you use pixel experience custom room this is not an option you have to use this thing it is already included pixel launcher and pixel goodies google play store and some pixel apps already included in pixel in pixel experience custom room and if i move on to one more major difference in both of these custom room is the safety net status if you use the pixel experience custom room 99.9 percent .9 of the times if you don't root your device you will see safe net is already passed by default but if you use lineage os safety net will not pass by default you need to fix that by using some modules and else things like that same like that if i move on to the settings ui as both of these custom rooms actually not having any customization so keep this thing in your mind both of these custom rooms are almost stock only few of the differences here and there which we are talking about right now but in the terms of customizations both of these custom room does not brings you any customizations Keep one thing in mind, Lineage OS brings you fingerprint unlock support, but it does not brings you the support for face unlock. I tried a lot of Lineage OS custom rooms right now, but it doesn't give you that face unlock, so keep this thing in your mind. But if you use Pixel Experience custom room, depends upon which device you're using, but you will get the face unlock support. So if you use face unlock, Pixel Experience provides you, but Lineage OS does not brings you the facility of using face unlock on your device. Another major difference in both of these custom room is the game space or basically game dashboard which is available by default in Pixel Experience custom room because it is having all the pixel props but Lineage OS will not give you this facility. You can't use game dashboard because it's the part of Google things I think so because this is a major difference so moving on to other options right now quick settings panel. This quick settings panel is one of the major differences. We have the light quick settings panel if you, do the light, if you use the light mode in Lineage OS, but not in Pixel Experience. They provide you dark quick settings panel. Same like that, this is the new thing which is a trust, which is basically an Android app or app which is pre-installed, which gives you some kind of information regarding if your device is encrypted, what is the Selenux status and the USB related option in privacy, which is a very useful thing. But this option as expected is not present in Pixel Experience. Another thing is this is the Lineage OS which I'm using right now and it supports OTA. I'm using unofficial, but that's completely fine. If you use official version, it supports OTA. Pixel Experience also also supports OTA but if you move on to other customizations these are the similarities right now if you are able to notice some status bar icons which you can enable or disable options related to some buttons which is having the control playback option we also have some gestures options for you which is just identically same and the same option are actually provided by pixel experience custom room 2 lineage os and pixel experience both brings you same kind of things only few differences like swipe to screenshot which might be included if you use a lineage os unofficial version and one of the things keep in mind because both of these custom rooms have some differences and some similarities but things might be different which device you are using 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ यू यूज लेनी जो एस ट्वेंटी विच इज नॉट ऑफिशियल अवेलेबल फॉर यू एडवाइस बट इफ आर हैविंग अनऑफिशियल वर्जन थिंग्स माइट माइट बी लिटिल बिट डिफरेंट हेयर एंड देयर बट मोस्ट ऑफ द थिंग्स आर बेसिकली सेम दीज वर थिंग्स आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू लेट यू नो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग एंड आई होप लाइक दिस आई विल सी इन द नेक्स्ट वन अंटिल दैन गुड बाय